Welcome to Gene Clips. My name is Andy and I am a genetic counselor at Children's National Hospital. Today, I will be talking about variants in the MTHFR gene. As you may know, the genes in our DNA provide the instructions that make us who we are. They determine which traits we inherit from our parents, but they also tell our bodies how to develop and work properly. Humans have over 20,000 genes in every single cell of our bodies. We have two copies of each gene, one inherited from our mom and one inherited from our dad. One gene name that you may have heard of is MTHFR. MTHFR stands for methylene tetrahydrofolate reductase. At one point, the MTHFR gene was a popular research subject. Researchers were trying to determine how variants or changes in the code in this gene would impact a person's health. There were two variants identified often, C677T and A1298C. During the early period of this research, scientists thought these changes could be associated with various health concerns, including pregnancy losses, autism, heart disease, depression, anxiety, and breast cancer. However, over time, it was discovered that roughly 30% of the general population has one or both variants in their DNA. Currently, there is no proven link between either of the common variants and any of the previously mentioned ailments. For this reason, current medical guidelines advise not to test patients for the common MTHFR variants. It is not necessary to make changes to your medical management based on these variants. Other variants in the MTHFR gene, ones that are not commonly tested for, have been proven to cause significant disease. These severe MTHFR mutations are very rare. Individuals with severe MTHFR deficiency have clinical concerns starting at a young age. Complications of severe MTHFR deficiency include seizures, strokes, intellectual disability, and movement issues. Your genetics provider can answer any questions you have about the MTHFR gene. Thank you for watching Gene Clips.